Hello guys, friends. Uh, today uh, we will learn how to do mail merging in Microsoft Word. Uh, the first step is just uh, opening the Microsoft uh, Word application. Here it is, Microsoft. Uh, I am working with Microsoft Word 2010, uh, or you may have different version. Here is the window and uh, the first thing uh, to do mail merging is just uh, clicking on uh, mailing stuff here. Uh, so from this uh, tab uh, we have different uh, uh, commands. Uh, that is uh, the link to start mail merging, start mail merge. Then uh, there are different types of templates of uh, mail merging or document templates uh, so from the first uh, from the first beginning to start with the, the wizard uh, you have to click on a step by step uh, mail merge wizard uh, that is found on the uh, last command uh, when we have clicked on it uh, we have get this uh, pane mail merge pane uh, there are different uh, Totally, there are uh, six uh, steps to do mail merging. Uh, the first step is uh, selecting uh, document type. Uh, by default, uh, I have uh, to select on the letters template. If uh, if you uh, want to change it, you can select from uh, the rest of the list. Uh, so the first is selecting document type. What kind of document is where we are working to send or we are uh, distributed for uh, recipients. Uh, then uh, I have selected on the default letters. Then and the next step is just starting a document. Here, starting a document means if you have a saved document, you can use that document by opening the document. Uh, from this, you can open a saved uh, Word document. But from start uh, for starting uh, for uh, uh, sorry, uh, but if you are starting for the first time, you can use the current document. Means you have to write the letter here. So just uh, let us select this. Um, select the current document. The next step is just select the recipients that you are going to send the letter in the third uh, step the third step is selecting uh, recipients uh, here also uh, there are three uh, options the first is use an existing list list means uh, if you have saved your contact lists uh, by using other applications uh, for example by using excel or access database you can select uh, the file or the second uh, is just uh, you can select from Outlook contacts. As you know, Outlook uh, Microsoft Office Outlook is used to uh, used as a mail application. Uh, so if you have contacts on that Outlook application, you can select from that uh, contact. Uh, the uh, last or the third option is just type. Just start typing a new list. You can uh, type a new list. For example, let, let us show it, or let me show you. Uh, when uh, we select type a new list option, the link is changed into create. Then clicking on create, you can enter uh, here the contact list. For example, uh, title. Uh, Mr. That's the first name. Let us file you. And uh, for last name, the um, guy. Okay. You can enter uh, company. You can uh, enter address, or you can enter address list two and city. For example, Addis. Ah, blah, blah. The other states, for example, Shawa, 
can enter zip code if necessary. A country, for example, Ethiopia. After uh, finishing uh, inter entering of the uh, contact list of the first person, then uh, you can click on new entry to add second contact list here. Yes, uh, in similar ways, you can uh, enter uh, the uh, details of uh, the second contact, the third, the uh, fourth, and so uh, as you want. Uh, but um, for today, uh, I have to use an existing links list uh, because I have uh, uh, a created contact list. So uh, let me select use an existing list and just browse or open the uh, contact list file from the Excel. Uh, my file is uh, here in documents folder uh, and the type is just uh, Excel. I've created the contact list with uh, Microsoft Office Excel. And that is uh, contact the file name is contact. Uh, here is the contact uh, list file name. Okay. Uh, when uh, I open the worksheet, uh, the second step is selecting the sheet. Uh, in my case, uh, the contact list is just on the first sheet, so no need of changing it. Yeah, here uh, is the contact list I have created. Uh, my contact list is just a uh, field of last name, first name, title, address, city, state, and country. No more fields here. In my case, you can add uh, multiple. Uh, Build this uh, above it. So uh, here, uh, all contacts uh, have selected already. If you want uh, specific uh, persons, you can select specific contact lists to send the mail. But if you want uh, for all uh, contacts to be sent uh, later, you have, you can select it by clicking on it once. So, uh, I want to send uh, all uh, send to all the contacts. So, uh, after selecting the contacts, click on OK. Then the next uh, step here is uh, writing the letter. Okay, um, there are templates here to work with. Uh, for example, the here. Uh, uh, the address uh, contact or the address block have to be uh, placed here. So uh, by simply clicking on the address uh, block, you can uh, enter the address block. Uh, when you click on the address block, uh, there are uh, preview here. What type, uh, in what ways uh, the contact, uh, the address block uh, will be displayed? For example, uh, here other here and uh, different uh, formats uh, are there here so uh, you can select whatever you want uh, to dis be displayed as so uh, there are here options you can adjust it uh, the, yeah, then uh, you, you can preview the contact also uh, rather selecting the uh, template for example, here is the first contact, here is the second, and the third, the fourth, then the fifth. No more contacts. Yeah, there are only five contacts. So after that, uh, click on OK. This is one way. Uh, but you can individually insert uh, the fields uh, here. You can insert only the title field, you can insert only the last name field, you can insert the uh, first name field uh, all the fields will be displayed uh, in your contact uh, then on the next line uh, there uh, the greeting line uh, be uh, displayed here uh, greeting line means uh, starting for with uh, here 
customized uh, word there you can change it for example you can you can change it hello then the uh, different formats here for example here you can uh, preview how it will look like hello mr alamo or for example let it be dear as the default dear mr alamo then dear miss hello like this then click on ok here you can uh, write the name or the body of the letter here as uh, this is a demonstration uh, letter uh, let it be the sample paragraph of the Microsoft Word here uh, here is the body in my case but uh, if you are doing on the uh, real email uh, here you, you have to put the real content or the real letter of the uh, the document then you can add uh, different uh, parts here for example your Let us finish our uh, writing our letters then uh, the next step is or uh, step 5 of 6 is just previewing the letter preview here uh, you are seeing what the letter will look like after printing the letter here here is the address block here is a greeting line here is a body and Here is the, for the first uh, person, Mr. Hyrule Alamu. Then the next uh, recipient, Mr. Dan, uh, Mirs Daniel Hale. Then uh, the last, uh, Dr. Barrett Bergen. As uh, like this, you can preview the letter. Then the last step is just completing the merging process. Yes, you, you have done it. So the last step is just printing the letter for those contact lists uh, latest point you can uh, specify the uh, contacts to be uh, printed the letter uh, by default uh, all uh, records will be uh, printed or all contacts uh, will have a print out of copy of this letter uh, if you want you can select current record means uh, the document will be printed only for uh, Ms. Vesele uh, Mangustu or you can uh, select uh, from uh, contact list 1 to someone 3 and in my case uh, let it be uh, printed for all of the contacts then uh, ok and this is the Selecting your printer, then adjusting uh, different uh, settings, then OK. Let it be on the desktop and the name is later. Just save it. I have selected a PDF printer, not a real printer. You can uh, use the real printer to uh, print out the hard copy of the process. Uh, then uh, let us see the letter. Here is uh, printed out in the form of PDF file. Uh, you can see uh, the for the first uh, contact list and uh, the next contact list uh, like this. Uh, the third and the next. The fourth and the final contact list. Five 
copies of uh, the letter is printed for five contact lists. Uh, this is all uh, how to do mail merging in Microsoft Office Word. Uh, thanks. Uh, subscribe uh, our channel uh, to get more uh, video tutorials. Thanks for watching.